Today, procurement teams are facing mounting pressures, more suppliers, tighter budgets, and higher expectations for speed and compliance. Manual processes, they just can't keep up. According to a recent report from the IBM Institute of Business Value, 64% of CSCOs and COOs say that generative AI is already transforming their supply chain operations workflows. And at the forefront of this transformation are AI agents, which are now considered the future of procurement and contract management. Procurement brings with it vast amounts of data from within the organization, from suppliers, from market insight databases. So today, we're gonna dive into four key ways that AI agents can support and transform procurement, making it smarter, faster, and more resilient. Now, the first is supplier management. AI agents can automate supplier onboarding by collecting documentation, by uh, verifying compliance, and even by routing approvals. These benefit from the autonomous nature of AI agents, which continuously assess supplier risk using real-time data from internal systems and external sources to identify potential disruptions early on. Now, the next is sourcing and contracts. So with AI agents, teams can accelerate sourcing by comparing suppliers and by even uh, tracking the RFX responses that they're getting and recommending preferred vendors. You know, AI agents can even analyze real-time data and contracts to flag risks. And they can monitor the expirations of certain contracts or even suggest clause updates based on changing policies. The third way is invoice management. Now, using an AI agent helps a procurement team to match invoices to POs and receipts. They can detect discrepancies. They can uh, trigger approvals. They can even um, look at exceptions and reduce the manual errors and speed up overall payment cycles. Now, the fourth one is purchasing. An AI agent streamlines the purchase request to order process by validating budgets, by enforcing policy compliance, and even by, again, automating those approvals and the PO creation so that these systems are connected and functioning in a more efficient way. Now, of course, these four use cases, they don't occur in their own little vacuums, and AI agents aren't designed to work in separate vacuums either. So let's walk through an actual example of an integrated AI agent supporting uh, a team at a global manufacturing company, let's say, and they are looking to manage procurement for critical electronic components. Now, through a Dunn and Bradstreet integration that this company has, the team has an AI agent continuously monitoring supplier data feeds for real-time risk detection. And unfortunately, the system does detect a sudden drop in the financial health score of a key supplier due to regional disruptions. So we have that real-time risk assessment. Then the agent triggers an automated risk alert, flagging the risks and a response querying SAP Ariba for alternative approved suppliers of the same component, being able to filter by lead time, compliance history, ESG scores, whatever the team has decided to prioritize. Now, based on this list, the AI agent then triggers a dynamic sourcing action. So using historical performance data and current RFX responses, the agent can recommend a preferred vendor and draft a sourcing proposal for the team to review. Now, before finalizing, the team uses the AI agent for contract intelligence, right? It has it analyze the proposed contract using NLP 
to flag outdated clauses and suggest any updates based on both the internal policy changes of the company and also recent regulatory shifts in the market. From there, once you have the approvals, the agent can then push a PO through to Coupa, syncing the invoice expectations and delivery timelines and set up automated invoice matching. So again, seamless execution for through these first three steps. And post-transaction, the agent can maintain a feedback loop where it logs the performance metrics and supplier responsiveness into the procurement data lake, which improves future sourcing models from supplier management to purchase and beyond. That is just one example of how all of these benefits of AI agents can work to support a procurement team from supplier management through the purchase process. I'd be remiss, however, if I didn't include some of the best key practices when integrating AI agents into your procurement operations. So the first, and I'm sure you've heard this one before, you have to ensure your data accuracy. Look, as we all know, AI is only as good as the data it's trained on. So you need to make sure that you have historical data and your current data prepared prior to implementing your AI agent technology. Have a system in place to manage uh, and sort the data constantly so that the agents are always working with the most accurate and up-to-date data to make this chain of events even better. Next, and going hand in hand with data, is establishing your standards and guidelines to actually govern the use of AI and specifically this AI agent. You have to teach the agent how to interact and operate. Creating standards ensures that the agent is following consistent set of rules, processes, and that the behaviors are predictable and aligned with your organization. Whether it's handling supplier relations or processing your data, Standards offer a reliability and allow you to build trust both internally and across the many different contexts where this AI agent might be used. Next, get your employees ready. Introducing an AI agent technology fundamentally is shifting how they're going to work. So you want to make sure that they are prepared to understand and not feel overwhelmed or resistant to the use of AI technology. If they are resistant, that's going to hinder its effectiveness and also, quite frankly, the ROI on it. So balance the excitement of introducing this new technology with the understanding that employees may have concerns and questions. You need to address those concerns, prepare them through upskilling and reskilling, and maintain clear communication and transparency. Finally, Introduce AI agents gradually. This is a not one and done thing. It is a purposeful, strategic introduction and use of AI agents to allow for more controlled and risk managed integration across the company. Organizations should deploy tests or pilot programs for specific procurement processes even using early use cases where you know AI agents are probably going to deliver more immediate value. This allows a business to identify any potential issues. You can detect those bugs early on and fine tune your AI system and the agent in order to deliver the greatest value moving forward.